Giant Fitness just came out with its new high-low push-pull sled. I was able to snag this on Black Friday for only 200 bucks, making it one of the best deals on a sled that I've seen from a reputable fitness company. Not on sale, the sled is priced at $250 and comes with both the upright bars and low bar attachment. The price point puts Giant's sled about $50 cheaper than a similar sled from Rogue, but because it comes with the low bar attachment, which Rogue charges another $50 for, it's actually closer to $100 bucks cheaper. It's also $50 cheaper than Titan's Pro Sled Core Unit and $100 cheaper than Rep's 4 Post Push Pull Sled, which despite the name only comes with two detachable posts, not four, and neither comes with the low bar attachment. Giant Sled does come in $70 higher than the overall pick on Amazon, but like anything with Amazon, it's difficult to research quality from a brand no one's ever heard of, though this one does seem to have pretty favorable reviews. First thing I notice is everything is pretty well packaged with bubble wrap and plastic, with some additional packaging to prevent dings and scrapes. I was surprised how heavy each piece was. Everything felt durable and high quality right off the bat. I did notice that Giant doesn't list the weight, material, or dimensions of the sled on their website. Or if they do, it's not that easy to find. Rep, Titan, and Rogue all list this information, and even though it isn't that important to me as a home gym owner, it might be nice to include for interested actual gym owners. Thankfully, there were only a handful of bolts needed to put the sled together. Though putting it together was fairly intuitive, it would have been nice to have had instructions with the steps written out with a short explanation. For assembly, I used this socket set from Home Depot that I've had for years. You can pick it up for under 20 bucks. I was really impressed with the look and feel of each piece, especially the dual giant logo cutouts and the centerpiece. I also liked that the centerpiece had a cutout for a rope attachment on each side. These skids were so nice, I almost don't want to mess them up. But like most home gym owners, I don't have nice turf or yards worth of mats, so they're going to get messed up. The whole thing took about 25 minutes to unpackage and assemble. So all in all, you could be dragging this sled down the block in a few minutes after buying it. I like that the uprights and low bar are easy to detach, so you don't need to turn the whole sled around to change directions. Overall, it's a great looking piece of equipment, and I'm excited to put it to the test. I tested the sled in my driveway because I figured this is where most home gym owners would use the sled, and it worked out pretty well. Both the uprights and low bar attachment were great. Everything felt sturdy and the skids moved well across the concrete. Just make sure to clear your driveway before using. Even a small pebble can stop you in your tracks. I really like the low bar attachment. I felt this immediately in my glutes and hamstrings, even using a light load. Oh, we got a freeloader. I bought this weight belt attachment on Amazon for around 40 bucks. Giant doesn't appear to make a belt or harness to go with the sled, so that would be something they should consider in the future to sell separately or as a package. So far, I love this sled, and I think for the price, it offers outstanding quality, appearance, and usability. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.